Welcome to Good Mythical More. You're here because you want to know what condiment makes the best fart sound. Uh -huh. Kudos. But first, would you like a random disturbing fact? How yeah. about every unborn baby grows a mustache in the womb which spreads to its entire body? What? Uh, during the second trimester of pregnancy, all babies grow fine hair on their upper lips that then spreads to the rest of their bodies. In most cases, this hair called lanugo. Oh, I've heard of lanugo. It, it, I thought it was a boy band. <laughs> <laughs> Falls out before the baby is born and is reabsorbed or eaten by the baby in the womb. Like, like babies in wombs are strange. Yeah, they'll eat anything. Uh, yeah, sometimes a baby will come out with with a little bit of that lanugo on it. Yeah, like you'll have a hairy baby. Yeah, if the but, lanugo but it'll go, holds on, but it'll go away. Don't yeah. worry. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just kind of like if you, uh, you know, if like me, if they go in there with the um, with the clampers, the forceps, with the clampers on the head, like the head's gonna be a little weirdly shaped. It'll Forever. Lie. And then you just blow on the baby's nose and mouth at the same time, and it just, coing, it yeah, all right. comes it's back a out. Doctor, a good doctor could do that. Right, right, right. All right, let's make some predictions here. Uh, what do we think is gonna get the b best fart? And it really, I mean, it's a combination of the viscosity of the liquid and the, uh, the, the machination of s squirt. I think that the ketchup consistency is the best for a fart noise, but I think that the technology of the opening has addressed that it's in a kind way of that like a ranch has not thought about it. Like so, this Heinz, I think it has a, it, a membrane. It, it has one pierces. of those. It has like a prolapsed sphincter. Yeah, right. It has a sphincter, and um, they don't do the sphincter on a ranch, so it doesn't work as good. The Hidden Valley, they haven't found the sphincter yet. See, it's just a. I think this is gonna I'm going to do it with ranch. Ranch right. is going to be the best. I have a um, an on brand story, uh, for this particular more. And also, do you have a prediction? So, cause mm. Red's saying ranch, I'm saying mayo is the best farter. I'll go ketchup to make things interesting. Okay. Uh, okay. So, and we we're were gonna... having a crew-wide production meeting, and um, I heard Ringo barking hysterically more than he does for a delivery. So yeah. I was like, okay, somebody's here and I need to go take care of this, but our, our whole team is on this production call. So I got up, I was frazzled. Ringo's barking, I have to hold him back. He's a monster, he has no manners. He's scratching at me, he's trying to, to go places. Yeah. And it is our one of our neighbors and um, her her cute little, probably like, four-year-old girl and they have baked us brownies Aww. and the girl has brownies all over her face <laughs> and I'm like holding on to Ringo and I'm like I, I, I'm on a, I, I'm on a big call I, I I'm you know I, I can't I'm sorry and I and I felt so bad I was like trying to communicate like I can't do this right now but also be thankful for the brownies yeah. and this cute like, little girl through a screen door or what yeah you know, i had opened the door so i was still holding ringo screen, at which, this which point time you saw a screen door in southern california yeah. <laughs> um so I, I you know i took the brownies but i felt like she's like oh so sorry you know and um and of course the little girl's like this jerk i don't understand what's happening so yeah. then i come back to the to the meeting and um the next the next conversation is and we're doing uh, which condiment bottle farts the loudest? Yeah. And I was like, that's what my, I just communicated to my neighbor. I was on a, a very, important very important production call. Yeah. call. I could not entertain her this daughter. This stuff is important, Stevie. Man, Stevie. You get it. Stevie, yeah. I, thought, I thought this was going to be a fart story. Like that little girl just ripped one. <laughs> And well, then she probably did. Ringo attacked her have. face trying to eat the brownie. The average person farts and then you 14 farted? times a day. And it was I mean, so it, loud. It's some wet in there. Okay. Oh gosh. All you right. know what? I get what? I get plenty of DMs. We don't need to go into it. <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna. Sh should I take? Let's do this. How do we do this consistently? Should I? Should I take all of it to the bottom and then? Or I, I think we need to not. experiment. I, I I think uh, I'm gonna do it on the side. Yeah. Every yeah, let's get, get 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 it going on all the right, side. So here's um, here's mustard. 
Well, that was that was quiet. That's not gonna work. It's got to be at the bottom. It may all have to come out. There we go. That's huh. forceful. It's a that's you pushing way too hard. You know, when a fart comes out at hyper velocity, that sounds like that hurts a, too. A breathing problem, not a fart. Yeah, that's that's nothing. That's like it's like an angry cat. Yeah, I mean it's loud, it's proud, it's uh, it's intimidating, but it's, it's out of here. It's not a it fart. Sucks. You want to go? Well, I kind of want to save our predictions for last. Go go for that one. Okay, I don't have high hopes for this relish. I mean, look at the hole. Oh, that is a thing. big hole. That's a gaping hole. All right, just just give it a good fart shot. Oh, 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 oh! You know. If your body makes that noise, yeah, check your pants. <laughs> <laughs> check your pants. This noise, this noise. <laughs> if your body makes that noise, you don't even need to check your pants. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You don't even need to check them if that happens. You, you don't know. even need to check. Here you need go. to listen, change listen, your listen. pants. Listen. Oh. It's out. Squeeze it and suck it back up in there to give it another fart shot. Well, no, there's still some in there. It's just, it doesn't have a lot of liquid in there. It's just gotten to like dry relish. If your body makes that kind of noise. Oh, here, here we go. I, oh, we, I, got, we got what we needed. You think that's better? I think that's better than ketchup. I mean, better than mustard. Of course. Mustard is horrible. Mustard is out. That sounded like it Are could you not come from ranking your body. them? You're just like. Completely eliminating well, no, them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We We're eliminating them. We do have ranking stickers. Oh, yes, okay. But we don't know yet, so we just, for right now, we just know that. This is number one. This is better than than mustard. All right, well, you do one on your side. Uh, Ken's Chunky Blue Cheese. That is a good blue cheese. My mama had that in the fridge all the time. And, mm. and oh, that is a gaper. But the, but the chunk, the chunks create problems. Trust me. <laughs> okay, let me. <laughs> what I mean, did you see what just happened? The whole thing just transferred into the bowl with no noise. Uh, maybe it's technique though. Oh, yeah, oh, that's a relish. It's a relish thing, but it's not as good as the relish. No, horrible. It's a reject, man. Horrible. That's that. That's. I think that's worse than mustard. If your body makes that noise. Check All right, we'll move pants. to catch up and save our two. Our two. All right. So this is Stevie's prediction. Stevie, this is your, this is your, this is your pick here. I'm going, starting off sideways. Again, there's a membrane there. Ooh, that was pretty good at the end there. Hmm. Mm mm. Now that first one was pretty good, man. I think that might be the best one so far. It no. It, it didn't sound like a fart at all, though. It has a higher pitch. The first one, let me see if I can suck some back in there. Wow. You are really draining it. Look at that. It's just all, it's all, it's all coming back in there. Reverse fart. <laughs> now just listen again. Give it a chance. Think of it as a small butthole. I mean, that's pretty farty, man. Does anybody agree with me? That's pretty. I agree. Farty? I agree. Everybody that's else pretty agrees. Farty. Well, it's your pick. Well, I know. <laughs> I think this is the number one right now. I think this is ahead of uh, ahead of relish by well, a little bit. I mean, I'm gonna go ahead and say uh, this is this is number five. We can change these. It was the chair. I swear, because it sound it didn't sound like a fart. It sounded like a chair to me. The way you're insisting on playing this game <laughs> is so interesting to me, Link. <laughs> Are you surprised? What do you mean? All right. Well, I was like, okay, are we ranking them? You're like, yeah, we're yes. gonna make them, but no, we're gonna dismiss some. And then Rhett was like, well, also we have stickers, so after we rank them, we can put the stickers on. And then you were like, no, I'm gonna take our number one seed, put the number five sticker right. on it no, now. So the best one so far is now number five in yeah. No, that's the number two. I didn't know there were numbers. Like, so that would be. This is number two, by the way, though. Okay. The so relish number is number two. one. So Not according to Rhett. Okay, I think that the ketchup is better than the relish. Well, but uh, no, go, go with the ranch. We're gonna need we're gonna need a bigger 
spoke. It's just too much. We need like a big bowl. This is all coming out. Oh, God. Just give me, you know what? Just a trash can. Right into the trash can. Ew. You ever crapped in a trash can? Probably. Do you hear that? It's too smooth. Not as good as ketchup. It's too smooth. I'm telling you. The, the liquid's too smooth. Not as good as ketchup. Yeah, I mean, that's a blowout. It's too liquidy. I mean, I've seen, I've seen the walls of a public restroom look like that. Yeah, but, but it darker. wasn't white. <laughs> uh, how do they do it? You go into a public restroom, it's like, how did it, ha how? Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. looking, like, I'm craning my neck upwards. You're like, I would love to see how this happened. You're like, no, I would not love yeah, to see how this happened. But it's just like, how does it happen? Uh, well, I've got quite a lot of mayonnaise in this. Let's, we might go to the trash can here in a second. It's got a canicular They've really funnel. Made, they've made these better than they were in like the 80s. They've made them to fart less. They're like, well, this, there's somebody at they don't these want places to like, mm, I've got to get rid of the farting. Yeah. Th they, they've done it scientifically. They've made that perfect. It's I a mean, did you see that? I bet they, did, they formed a task force for it. Mm-hmm. A fart task force. A fart force. It sounds chir too chirpy. Again, what's the best so far? The, the relish. Carney, Carney said it sounded like a dolphin, which yeah, I totally it agree. Yeah, it does sound a little bit. How do I? The relish was a good ploppiness, which sounded. It said the relish sounded like somebody took a crap in their pants. It didn't sound like a fart. It was a shark. If your body makes that it noise. It was a shark easily. Check your prank. This was a fart. Ketchup was a fart. Listen, if ketchup wins, it, it's okay that I was not very nice to the little girl who made me brownies with that was very cute. I'm just telling you, but listen to this, guys. <laughs> Wait, just unscrew it. Back in. <laughs> <laughs> really? Can that be done? Well, now it's dirty. I mean, I'll, I'll gladly give the relish number two. Because it does sound like something that came from a human body. Get it? Get it? Number two? Right, yeah, but it, it sounds like a number two. See what you've done, Ben? ben. <laughs> Way to go, Ben. Ah, uh, you need a funnel. You have to take off the top of the mayonnaise and funnel the relish back into its own self. Cheek splitter. And again, just that for reference, disappointment. just for reference, I gotta get this back in here. N none of them are farting in the no, way that I expect. Here, here you go. Look at that. Shh, shh, let me do this. Sounds like a bird. Before I do this, I wanna say that the new society exclusive item, the newest one, the Mythical Society onesie, you gotta get it, sign up for third degree quarterly or annual by September 30th to uh, qualify. MythicalSociety.com. Get you that onesie that we got over here. That's a farty sound. Oh, come on. I mean, that's a too complex. I just want to get one more of these out. Yeah. I mean, that's diarrhea. It really is. I think the sonic sphincter goes to ketchup. Stevie, you were right. And, um, yes! Hardy, but farty, <sighs> wet and wild. Yes. I mean, this is, this is wet and wild, too. I'm just telling you. It's also wet. It, it, it gets it wins multiple awards. Yeah. <laughs> and the I think the best design is the mayonnaise. I think it looks it has a great aesthetic. I think that the way that thing poured without splatter at all and very little farting. So Hellman's wins the best design. And apparently you win. To get the Mythical Society onesie, join third degree quarterly or annual by September 30th. Visit mythicalsociety.com for details.